Mr. 259 Radios here. Uh, today we're working on a Cobra 148 for Ben and Anigo. Uh, we already got the light filter replaced there uh, for the channel indicator. And now I just got it hooked up to the analyzer. I'm going to show you what it's doing for power uh, before we modify it so you can see where it was at and then you can have something to compare to when we're done. I got the test connector there hooked up and uh, that goes in the analyzer over here so I can inject a test tone into it and see what it's doing a little easier. Okay, so in the power meter here, we're looking at the scale on the left. It's in the uh, the low setting now. So that scale actually goes from 0 to 30 watts up at the top there. Alright, so we'll key it up. It's doing right about a 7 watt dead key. And you can see on the analyzer, it's measuring about the same thing. Looking at this number right here, just a little over 7 watts. And uh, if I go ahead and put some modulation to it, see it's right up around uh, almost 12 watts or a little over 10 there uh, it's reading the same on the analyzer there that's average power uh, now if I switch it to peak power about 27 watts peak with the modulation going into it and on the scope here not looking too bad it's just a little over 100% modulation there 101 so a little bit of clipping but not too bad uh, like I said, we haven't made any adjustments in there yet. That's just how it came. Uh, and then uh, it's got pretty clean output, even with a little bit of clipping on it. It's not doing too bit too bad. So, all right, we'll get it all tuned up, and we'll be back and show you what it's doing when we're done. Uh, or wait, actually, that's right. I was going to hook up the microphone so you could see what it's doing on there as far as modulation. Let me get that hooked up here real quick. So it does come out a little different. The microphone usually doesn't uh, give you quite as much of a deflection on that meter as putting a one killer tone into it. So we look at it on the meter here. Audio, one, two. Audio, one, two. Audio. Right up around 9 to 10 watts. And on here for peak power. Audio, one, two. Audio. Audio, one, two. So 7 watts swinging up to about 28. Uh, 7 watts is a pretty high dead key on these things. Uh, we're going to probably set the dead key a little bit lower on that and uh, get it swinging a little better. That'll make you sound nice and loud on AM. Alright, we'll be back after after we're all done. Alright Ben, we're back with the 148 GTL here. We got a new meter put in and uh, put a white LED in there for you so you don't have to worry about that burning out. Uh, also back here we uh, added a bigger uh, reverse polarity diode and a filter cap right here. And then I wanted to show you real quick before I do the frequency alignment on it uh, how far off it is on. I have a, right now I got it on upper side band. Audio, audio, one, two, one, two. You can hear it's a little off frequency there. Uh, let's see, red. Focus it right. Twenty-seven one eight five right there. If I go down about three hundred hertz, then it sounds all right. Audio, uh, audio one two. Hello, audio. And same thing for lower side man. Audio, audio one two. Hello, audio. Your sideband's a little off there. We're going to do a calibration on that. Get that back on frequency where it's supposed to be at. Uh, we'll check out the AM side here. And uh, let's see. Not too bad. You can see up in the top left there, a big number. It's only off by uh, about 70 hertz. That's not too bad. But we'll get that zeroed out anyway. So we'll be back uh, after we get the alignment all done and get it buttoned back up and show you how it turned out. All right. All right, Ben, here it is. It's all done. Got the uh, new meter put in there with the white LED uh, lens put in place where it should be. And uh, did an alignment on it. 
got the sideband back on frequency and uh, got the power turned up for you. So let's show you what it's doing over here on AM side. Oh, the three watt dead key. Uh, yeah, about three and a half watts over there. Audio. Audio. Swinging right around 15. Audio. Now we'll go to peak power once. Audio. Audio. One, two. Audio. So right up around 30 watts on the AM side there. Doing pretty good. And uh, like I said, we got your sideband back on frequency. I'll show you that once here. Now it's going to be a little loud at first because the AGC and the analyzer, but... Audio, one, two, audio. Audio. There you go, doing about 30 watts on sideband. That's up quite a bit from where it was uh, by the factory. So, uh, overall, it's doing pretty good for you. I'll show you it on the spectrum analyzer here real quick. Back to AM. Audio. Nice clean signal on there too. So, 15 watts of uh, clean power average, about 30 peak. Should be uh, working real good for you. You're gonna be real happy with this thing. All right.